Hello and welcome to Suron South's video on how to change the brake pads on a Suron Light B. In this video, we will show you how to replace the pads in the rear caliper and the front caliper. To begin with, remove the safety retaining clip from the pad bolt. Then, undo the two caliper bolts using a 5mm hex driver. Due to laziness, we will finish this with the electric lazy gun. In this video, we will be removing and refitting the same pads as this is a brand new bike. Your bike, however, will probably have mud and brake dust inside the caliper. Remove the pad bolt and then slide the pads and spring out from within the caliper. Check to make sure that the pistons move freely in the caliper by pumping the brake lever a couple of times. If they do not move, then they need thoroughly cleaning or may be defective. Using some good quality brake cleaner, clean the caliper outside and in. Check to ensure that the pistons are pushed back into the caliper using a flat blade screwdriver protected with a cloth. Brake pads fit into the caliper with the spring in place between the two pads. Press the pads and spring together and fit them into the caliper. Slide them down until the spring and pads are aligned with the pad bolt hole. If you meet resistance, check the pistons are pushed back enough. Replace the retaining bolt and safety clip. Do not over tighten the pad bolt, it only needs to be nipped tight. We now need to reattach the caliper. Fit the caliper in place and do the bolts up with your fingers. Pump the brake lever a couple of times to push the pistons back into place. Then with the brake held on, tighten up the caliper bolts. This ensures that the caliper is aligned well with the brake disc. If the brake feels particularly spongy, then it is a sign that there might be air bubbles in the system and might need bleeding. We will cover this in another video. Torque up the caliper bolts to 12 newton meters using a torque wrench. The back brake is now complete. Let's move to the front. The process for the front caliper is exactly the same as the rear. Undo the caliper bolts to remove the caliper. Remove the safety retaining clip from the pad bolt and put aside. Undo the pad bolt and push up the pads to remove them. Clean the caliper, ensure the pistons move and install the new pads. Fit the pad bolt and retaining clip. Fit the caliper back to the mount and use fingers to tighten. Pump the brakes a couple of times and then squeeze tight while your garage monkey tightens the bolts up. Torque up to 12 newton meters and test. Congratulations, you have successfully changed your brake pads. We hope this video has helped you. For more how-to videos, please subscribe to our channel. If you need any parts, please visit our website at www.suronsouth.co.uk